Does Ghost New Peanut Butter Cereal Milk really taste like Reese's Puffs? Stick around because I'm going to discuss just that. Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to today's video. My name is Alex Holder. If you're new to the channel, how's it going? So today I'm going to be reviewing three of the products that, Ghosts, that Ghost has at the moment. Um, that is the milk chocolate uh, protein, the whey protein, and then the peanut butter cereal milk whey protein, and then the fish oil. Now, um, Ghost has a lot of pre-workouts, and I'm not really going to review any of those. I have taken the fruit punch one, and I'll just say that that was the best tasting pre-workout that I've ever had, and also sick pumps with it. So overall, the pre-workout is a good product, but I'm not really doing a review on it. I just wanted to say that. And so um, Ghost actually has a new protein coming out that is a blueberry, I don't even know, some blueberry flavored protein. I've heard it's good from the guys who, who uh, support or sponsor are sponsored by Ghost, have said that it's really good, but obviously they're going to say that. This is going to be an honest review. I'm not sponsored by Ghost, and they're not paying me to make this review. So just a little disclaimer. Um, this, is, this is going to be an honest review. I'm going to tell you my honest thoughts on these three products, um, tell you what's good about them, what's bad about them, and as far as taste goes, let's start off with that. So the peanut butter cereal milk. This actually is a quite well-tasting product. Um, as far as mixing it with water, personally, it's not the best unless if you do a very little amount of water. If you do like more than six ounces of water, it starts to, like the taste goes way down, but that's pretty much generic over any, any protein powder, depending on the taste. Does this actually taste like Reese's Puffs? Yes, I think it does. Um, if you mix it with milk or even like almond milk, something that isn't like primarily water, it is very good. Uh, mixability excellent it mixes very fast it doesn't get all clumpy and stuff like that so it mixes well and the taste is good as far as the price goes there is 26 servings for I think like 40 bucks so you know it's a little bit more expensive a little bit over a dollar a serving or a dollar a scoop and um, so as far as that goes it isn't the cheapest protein out there. You can go to Walmart and get whey protein for like 10 or 15 bucks and get an entire month or two supply. Uh, the macros on this are actually pretty good. 26 grams of protein, one and a half fat, and then four carbs for one scoop. Now, if you're somebody who likes to get a majority of your protein out of the protein powder, this isn't gonna be your product just because you're only getting 26 scoops for 40 bucks or however much it is. And then you are, if you're taking two a day, you're going to go through that 26 servings in about two weeks. So really, it's not the best product if you're somebody who takes a lot of protein. But as far as being more of a luxury protein, um, this definitely ranks there. It's not the highest in protein as far as pricing goes, but it is still a, a little bit higher on the pricing chart. Now, my camera's going to die, so let me go get my battery and then we'll... Uh, continue on the review. Okay, where was I? So this is a great product overall 1 to 10. I give it probably 8.5 Taste is good. The macros on it are good. It mixes well The only problem I have is the low number of servings for as big of a tub as this is um, This one's actually pretty full. I think I've only had a scoop or two out of it And it's like right there like they could have filled it up more and got like 40 servings at least but um Overall, pretty good protein. Now let's move on to the milk chocolate flavor. So this is pretty much goes the same. Um, taste on this, I actually like this taste better. Depending, like if I put this in oatmeal, I like this one better. But if I'm just drinking a protein shake, this goes better with water. And even with milk, I think this tastes better. Um, it tastes a little bit like hot chocolate that's cold. Now it doesn't taste quite like chocolate milk, but hot chocolate and chocolate milk or two different things, even if hot chocolate's cold, they taste different. So, in my opinion, this tastes like cold hot chocolate, and so I think, overall, the taste is incredible. Um, again, the same things apply as far as costing a little bit more for what you're getting. But, you know, if you can afford that, then this is a great product for you to buy. Um, I'd probably give this one probably an 8.5 too. They're just so quite similar. Um, yeah, 8.5 or 9 on the milk chocolate, but pretty two pretty good proteins, 
protein powders. And then the last item is this ghost fish oil. So a lot of good things to say about this ghost fish oil. So I'll show you a capsule. They have this weird coating. Do you see that? They have this weird coating on the outside that makes it so that when it goes into your stomach um, and you're digesting it or whatever, you don't get like bad fish oil burps. So if you've ever taken fish oil pills or even like fish oil shots, um, you get like, like you'll burp and it'll taste like fish oil and it's disgusting. So they, they pretty much eliminated that completely. I don't think I've had a single bad experience with this. Um, so pretty good, pretty good in that area. Another good thing about this is most fish oil pills, um, you have to take like four or five of them to get like the, the serving. And on this, you only have to take one. They got, they have every, all of the fish oil in one capsule. So you don't have to take more than one capsule. Um, you know, you're not throwing pills down your throat and also you don't have to worry about a bunch of bad fish oil burps. Now, another great thing about this product, in my opinion, is there's 60 servings in there. This will last you two months if you are taking the recommended dosages. Now, 60 servings, you'd think it'd be like 70 or 80 bucks. This is only $15 for this. I think I paid $20 to get it to my house with shipping. So, as far as that goes, I give this fish oil, compared to all the other fish oils, at least a 9.9. .9. This is probably the best fish oil I've ever had. Um, just the packaging, like, the packaging's sick, and overall, it's a good good fish oil, in my opinion. Um, like, you can get Walmart fish oil and stuff like that, but when it comes when it comes to, like, the fish oil burps and having to take a bunch of pills, because here's the thing, if you're taking four or five pills that don't have that, uh, that thicker coating on it, then you're going to be burping, like, a lot more. Like, with this, you're only taking one, and it's got the coating, so you don't have to worry about the fish oil burps. And then, again... 60 capsules for 15 bucks like that's it's unbeatable it's like a quarter that's like a quarter per capsule so that's very good um so overall between these three products um you know three pretty good products um would i get the protein again most likely yes the only like i don't know hopefully someday ghost will sponsor me but until then i'll probably keep buying this protein Pre-workout, I might buy that from them again. Um, the only reason I haven't is because it's June and I'm taking this month off from pre-workout. So whenever July comes, I'll decide what pre-workout I want to get back into and then just go from there. But for now, I'm not taking pre-workout, so that's why I don't have any. And then, yeah, so I would I would definitely buy probably both of these again. I'm interested to try the, the new blueberry flavor. I don't think it's out yet, but when it does come out, I might go ahead and get that just to try it out and maybe do a review on it. But hey guys, that's gonna conclude today's video. Thank you for watching. Um, you know, I hope you learned a little bit about these supplements and help you make a decision based on whether or not you wanna actually buy them. Um, if you enjoyed this review, please hit that subscribe button. Um, I would appreciate it a bunch. Let's build this community up, guys. Make sure you are subscribed to the channel for more videos that are coming out. And also, if you have any review ideas or any video um, topics that you want me to cover, leave them in the comments section. I read through all the comments. So if you have a, you know, a topic you want me to cover, put it down there, and I will definitely make a video on it. So thanks for watching again, guys. Make sure to subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video.